Right, so we've got a Volkswagen up in today, 2014, so we're just going to show you what we've found so far. Um, so first things first, in the driver's footwell, we can see that there's loads of water um, in the underlay. Um, we've got electricals as well, which are submerged in water, and this does actually go all the way through to the, the driver's rear as well. Um, so the only way of obviously getting this dry would be removing the seat, sucking the water out, and then putting our super dryer machine in now. Um, so we're just going to quickly show you what the problem is. So if we look on this arch, there's no water running out. The reason being is because that is blocked there, which is a drainage system. And if we have a quick look in there, you can see that it's submerging where the wire's going. And we have a little rubber grommet there as well. Um, so if we now go into the inside the car, now it's full up to the level. It should now reveal where the water is coming from. The only problem is we do have a box section here, so it could possibly be traveling down in the box section and then coming in. Okay, if I just position you there for a second. Right, okay, so it's a little bit of a secret one. The reason being is that welded seam, that welded seam here is letting out water. So what that must be doing is it's going down inside the skin between the bulkhead and where the scuttle wearer is, then running down the inside of the bulkhead. And then what it's then doing is it's exiting out of here and then that is causing us to have more water around here um, so we believe that would be the problem on that one now oh. okay any more information just click the, the tab down below